And it's time for us to go. We are loading up into the taxis. We've enjoyed three days in Rome, staying at the Hotel Tiziano here on the Corso Vittorio Emanuele. And now we're going to ride up to the Termini train station by taxi. It's just about a 10 minute ride. And we're going to be heading to Florence. Well, you haven't visited Rome until you've been into a Roman taxi. They drive like crazy. But these taxi drivers are quite honest and knowledgeable about the city, so they're not going to overcharge you or take you on a runaround. Don't worry about that. That was a terrific ride, and we are now at the Termini station. Get out of the taxis, pay the bill. Now we've got about a half an hour before the train departs. We like to get to the station a little bit early and we get our bearings and find out which platform the train's leaving from. And that gives us time to observe the station activities, which is always a fascinating sight. We head to the platform and get right on the train on our way to Florence. We're riding the Eurostar. It's a modern Italian train. It goes very fast. It's very smooth, quiet, and comfortable. There's tables, there's a snack bar. You can take pictures out the window and chat with your fellow travelers. The scenery is quite lovely. We're going into Tuscany, so the scenery transforms from farmlands to rolling hillsides and little villages off in the distance. And then, curiously, the police were taking an interest in the photography. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> just curious to see what we're photographing. No security problem here. They're just being friendly and having a look at the camera and making a little conversation with us as we arrive in Florence, right in the heart of town. Many tracks leading us into the Florence train station. The ride has just been an hour and a half from Rome to Florence.